Number 10, Code Geass Opening 5. Much like Blue Exorcist's second opening, Code Geass's fifth opening is lower placement is on this list has to do with just preferring the other openings to it. However, that said, I still love this opening and find it a very fitting final opening for Code Geass. Its visuals are great, and song are just great also. While a lot of people prefer the first opening, I kind of think it's a tad bit overrated, I prefer this opening, and for this, it's just great. Number 9, Paranoia Agents opening. Take the unsettling part of Higarashi's opening and amplify it tenfold, and you have this opening. It's even more unsettling than Higarashi's first opening, and that's saying something. Just seeing the characters laughing in the background just gives me the creeps. Especially if you've seen the show. It gives me goosebumps just listening to it, and it's extremely fitting to Paranoia Agent. And I love it to death. Number 8. Hunter x Hunter's opening. I know visually they change the opening every so often, but I count this as just one huge opening, probably because they never change the song. That aside, I fucking love this opening. It gives me such excitement for the next episode to come and is always a joy to listen to. I just get so pumped when I listen to it, just, ah, I love it so much. Number seven, Trigun's opening. Pull out that air guitar. This opening is just an awesome listen for me. And it reminds me why I love Tryon so much by just its opening parts and showing previews of what's to come in the episode. It's another that gets my blood pumping. It's just so freaking awesome. It's just, ah, I love it so much. It's a great opening and it's one I enjoy every time. Number six, Dorara's second opening. Okay, story time. I don't like the first opening. At all. I felt like it was trying to ride the success of Bakano's opening, but honestly, I found it backfired big time and was just annoyed listening to it each time. Not helping was the song, which even without the Bakano comparison, I didn't really like that much. Then comes the second opening, which I loved. Visually, while it still kind of looked like Bakano's opening in some ways, I didn't feel like it was writing on its success unlike the first opening, and I loved the song a lot more. It was the first step in my improvement toward how I felt about Dorara as a whole, and for me, it was a great opening that I enjoy a lot. Number 5. Full Metal Alchemist 03 Opening 2 My opinion of this opening has exploded since my original list. It's probably the most nostalgic anime opening for me, outside of a few English-made openings, and one I still absolutely love. Hell, that love has grown since my original list. While it didn't even break my top 10 back then, now it's my 5th favorite anime opening period. I just love everything about this opening, from its visuals, to the song, to the blood pumping feeling I get from it. Just, ah, I love it so much. Number 4, Bakano's opening. Remember when I mentioned the success of Bakano's opening during my Dorara entry? Well, here it is. My favorite instrumental opening in anime, Bakano's opening. There are no lyrics in Bakano's opening, but it doesn't really need them in the slightest. It conveys everything it needs to with just its visuals, introducing most of the cast and giving us a preview of the events to come in each episode. There's a lot in this opening, and for me, it shows in spades. I love this opening just so goddamn much. Number 3, Kiriko in a Basket Opening 3. Just, yes, 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 this opening. It has all the hype and all the excitement and energy I need. The visuals are just gorgeous, the song is just amazing, and combine that with just making something amazing, it makes my blood pump every time I listen to it. I just love it so much, just, yes! Everything is great about this opening. It's just amazing. Number 2, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure Opening 4. To be honest, if it wasn't for doing one opening per series, 
every JoJo opening would be on this list, and pretty high to boot. However, out of the JoJo openings, the fourth would be my favorite. A lot of that has to do with how unique it is that all the previous singers for each JoJo opening returns to sing this opening, something I've never seen done in any other anime as of yet. It also feels very fitting to Stardust Crusaders' second half with a feeling of desperation to defeat Dio and save Jotaro's mother, while still keeping to the other opening spirit. It's just a fantastic opening, and one I always come back to listen to quite often. Number 1. Gurren Lagann's opening. No words can even describe how much I love this opening. Take every positive I had with every entry on this list and increase it tenfold. This opening represents the spirit of Gurren Lagann, and it's just so amazing in every way. It is by far my favorite anime opening, and I think it well deserves that title. Anyways, that's all from me. This has been Star Six Wars 1, and I'll see you next time.